Hello there, beautiful beings. Welcome into Sage, Sense and Healing Tarot. Thank you for being here and I do hope you're well. Thank you for joining the channel. Thank you for supporting your like, share, comment, subscribe is abundantly appreciated. Please do continue to hit the like button, share and subscribe to the, to the channel if you have not done so already. This will be a general tarot card reading for the sign Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So welcome in Taurus. Your energy here means a lot to me. So breathe in. And I hope to get some accurate messages for what's going on in your energy field in this time, Taurus. Taurus, I am sensing that there is some sadness. I don't know, maybe coming from disappointment or feeling betrayed or unloved, uncared for. Let's see how you feel. Things are about to change though because this is aligning you with your sense of self-worth. Because you came here to, to realize that it, I don't want it to sound like I don't care about what you're going through. But the truth and the beauty in this is that you are going to realize, Taurus, what you're really made of. When it comes to really standing on your own. It's not that no one wants to support you. It's, you know, not, it's, and it has to do with where you're going and your vision for yourself. It's more like, you're not here to be supported, you know. You're here to be you, to, to move, to even, to, I don't know. It's, it's, it's just that. I can't really explain it. You're here to maybe to not carry a lot of people with you on your journey. Mm -mm. It's more like you're here to, um, I don't know, something about this loneliness, this feeling. Tell me more what Taz is here to do. What is the Six of Pentacles? You're here to almost like change the narrative on what being alone is. What it really means. You know, you're not here to be around a lot of people. Uh, why can't, I'm getting Jesus Christ energy, Taurus. I don't know why Taurus and Jesus Christ feels like they... Even though they say Jesus was, in fact, born in, in the month of April. Um, but Taurus, I'm getting that like you're, you're meant to be who you are. Different. Something about a destiny. I don't know if it's about wealth. It could be about wealth, your money, the things you're here to do. I feel like you're going to eventually have a family if you don't already, which you have created on your own. You understand what I'm saying? You're not supposed to already have. Oh God, I don't want it to sound mean. You know what I mean? I want you to understand like you are the one that would grow up move away to a whole different place and then start your entire family like from scratch like moving into the desert and then you start um little by little putting things together till you build a hut until you end up building an entire house till you find a way to bring water to that house you know to bring light electricity that's the kind of loneliness i feel for you you're innovative like you're very innovative and it pulls you away from being around many others you're just supposed to stand alone i can't i really want you to understand it's not like you don't have friends and family that love you you know but your mission what you are to do you're something different Taurus. as the bull oh yeah you know fucking yeah man i do feel like um as I say, you're creating uh, an empire for yourself, your own family, and it is from effing scratch. You're doing this on your own, and you're not sad about it. Tell me where Taurus's main support lies. You are good at following in your heart space, listening to your heart. I don't know if there's a mother around you, Queen of Cups, Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, someone that's nurturing, that looks at you with um, their energy, holds you with love. This could be your mother. Um, ugh, Taurus, this person, they... Um, 
they hold you in a good vibration. It's almost like someone praying for you, even though you may be distant from this person. This person could be, show me Taurus's energy, because you're, where's Taurus going? What's Taurus focusing on at this point? Messages. Oh, having the success, victory, maybe something, you're, a creative gift you're working on. I do feel music for you. Maybe you're going to detach. I do feel stardom for you too. You're going to detach from a person in your past. Maybe this is a person that's nurturing energy. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, mother energy, or just some feminine or masculine energy around you that loves you. Or, I don't know, something. Maybe you want to detach, or maybe this person is coming back. Tell me more about the Five of Swords. has to do with movement, feeling trapped, dislocated, or relent, laying things down, not moving a lot. Maybe someone needs to move or I don't know. Someone is going through a lot of transformation. Uh, you know, what is the four of diamonds? Creative eyes, spirit, energy, meditative. This person is maybe not speaking a lot, but still working our creative. And I hear source. What is the eight of wands? Oh, something needs to end maybe with this person. I feel like this person is um, bringing in a vision or some success with the sun energy, the three pentacles, sun energy, material success and abundance. I don't know, this person, I like this person's energy, could be a bias, but they're whipping. <laughs> I just get the feeling of this person is whipping, whipping out something or whipping someone or something ended, I don't know. What is Taurus's real feeling Start this person? The king, of, the king of pentacles repeated. All right. Mm. Okay. Maybe Taurus feels like they are better than this person in, a, in some shape or form. Maybe more abundant, more, a, more of a well-being. But that's Taurus's energy still, you know? Um, maybe in charge. Maybe doubtful maybe mm, i don't know if this person is trying to talk to you taurus i'm getting the energy of a mother i don't know if you turn your back on her or to look toward your bigger greater vision in life i do feel you could be led or guided by your feelings of intuition like money m-o-n-e-y but it's not just that it's a uh, feeling of well-being a lifestyle that you envision that you're moving toward of course i do feel family and love surrounding you your main focus though is getting to where your vision is this king of pentacles energy and that's complete abundance here not just financial well-being but overall just living a well life like a, a an abundant lifestyle I feel you are already representing as this abundant person, okay? There's this other person, I don't know, this water sign here, emotional person that is around you. Now, I don't know what you feel about this person. It's like you feel like, it's the energy of, um, I don't want to say belittlement, but the energy is, I don't know. You could love this one, you know. It's true. Could, you could love this person. But maybe at the same time, this person could be someone from your past, a past a family member, someone from your younger or just an old soulmate, really. So this, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I just feel like at this moment you just feel more... I don't know what you feel, more than this person, okay? More like, it's almost like you can't listen to this person right now, this, this, this female. Like you're just saying, she's there, but I just can't. I can't listen to you right now. What you're saying makes no sense. You're not, you're not, saying, you're not saying anything with sense right now. I have a place to be, things to do, play, people to see, whatever, whatever, whatever. So I'm going to leave you behind. I don't know. Or I'm taking you with me, Taurus. That's the overall of your energy in this message. I do hope you found some that inspire you and is able to help you along your journey. All right, I'm also here. If you have any questions relating to this reading, leave them in the comment section below and I'll answer. Like, share, subscribe. Your support um, is greatly appreciated. So I will see you in the next reading, Taurus. Much love. Until next time, remember that you're all and... All is within you. Take care. Bye.